Right, I'm Ashaya Holland. I'm a senior at Thomas Jefferson. Stir the beer! You always told me that I resemble a pistol. Without the safety on, I will cause damage. Without a silencer, I am far too loud. I often forget that I am not invincible sometimes to remind myself that you will cause harm. I tell myself that you never keep the safety on. You see me as an easy target. We'll always go where you need me, we'll always be what you want. You can always trust that I will let you pierce my side in an attempt to become something holy enough for you. At night, I go over what you've done. I dig for the bullets, try to locate the shells. One, you made me think that you wanted me. Two, you made me think it was my fault that your aim is impeccable and my reflexes are not. Four, or three, sorry. When I whisper your name in the darkness, it makes the same sound as a bullet slicing through the air around me. I have convinced myself that it is just my voice that incriminates you, that the eight letters leaving my mouth with the speed of a bullet is my undoing, and your existence climbing up my throat is the only reason I can see you as evil, but it's not. It's the fact that everything is a rigged game of Russian roulette where you've convinced me that I have a chance at winning. It's the fact that you don't see yourself as the semi-automatic shotgun you are. My name leaves your mouth. It sounds exactly like my demise, and I'd be lying if I said my broken heart didn't bleed like an open gunshot wound. Yet you fail to acknowledge the danger you put me in every time you open your mouth. You still ask me what you did wrong. Like the evidence isn't laying at your feet. The shells attached to memories of you aiming your gun and pulling the trigger without a second thought, without any warning. How dare you pretend like you didn't come after me with the illest of intentions. Yet you believe that my mouth is too dangerous to kiss. I am known to misfire. I might hurt you if you aren't careful. So surely you aren't surprised that I fired back. I have been taught to aim where I want, to shoot without thinking twice, to keep my safety on, to fire when I feel threatened and ask what your intentions were after. So what were you thinking when you broke my heart? You have known me to be gunpowder and silver bullets, and yet you thought it'd be smart to hurt me. See how long I would wait before pulling the trigger to see if I would want to hurt you, as if it were a question if I'd seek revenge. I know you think I'm a fully loaded revolver, because I will f release when I feel slighted, will fire out of spite, will spit bullet after bullet when I feel like I'm being taken for granted. I will hurt you the way you hurt me, will empty myself and wonder why you're not bleeding and I have nothing left, will put revenge over my safety because karma is never harsh enough, will always shoot from the hip, will always protect myself before I love someone else, because I learned that from you.